Your Disco Devil comes with the following. One Disco Devil machine, one power cord, two sets of two polishing pads, one 16 ounce bottle of polishing compound, one polishing cloth, and one one ounce bottle of final spray. Next we are going to power up the Disco Devil. Remove the twist eye from the power cable. Insert the power cable into the receptacle at the back of the machine. Plug the other end of the power cable into the wall. You will find the power switch located on the left hand side of the machine. Switch the machine on. This is the display panel. Shown here is the left menu button, stop button, start button, and the right menu button. Using one of the menu buttons, feel free to scroll through the various settings. Cycles include light, medium, and heavy. Press the upper right area of the polish compartment door to open it. This is your polishing liquid. Shake it for 10 to 15 seconds vigorously before use. Remove the lid before installing it into the devil. Insert the polish line into the bottle first before installing the bottle into the compartment. Carefully snap the bottle into place on an angle as shown. Then close the polish compartment door. These are your polishing pads. Remove them from the bag. This is the side that makes contact with the disc. This side snaps onto the pad holders. Notice the two alignment pins. These are the alignment holes on the pad holders. Align the pins on the pads with the holes on the pad holders and snap together. Here's a closer view. To remove the polishing pads, pull the pad toward you. If you are having difficulty removing the pads, turn the pad one quarter rotation clockwise and try again. Pushing the black button below the LCD display will open the lid of the devil. When placing a disc on the turntable, be sure to place it label side down. Choose repair cycle based on the level of disc damage, then press start. Once the cycle is complete, the machine will stop and a chime will sound. While removing the disc, first tilt the disc to the side to remove any excess polish. Place the disc on the polishing cloth. Using the final spray bottle, point and spray into the center of the disc. Wipe the disc in a circular motion until the surface is dry.
open the front door and remove the polish bottle. Fill the cleaning bottle with warm water. Install the cleaning bottle as shown. Place an unwanted disc in the machine for the duration of the cleaning cycle. Close the lid and the front door and select the medium cycle on the display and press start.